Welcome to part six of the Smithsonian Institute. My name is Gus Banks and the show as well as the museum are located here in America. As a collector I try to find Simpsons products from all around the world and I thought I'd share some of those with you from outside the US. So we're going to start in Mexico with a company called Sabritas. This is both sets of the Simpsons. This is the Simpsons indoors and the Simpsons outdoors. And my knowledge is Sabritas is the Mexican form of Dorito chips. And then as we move to Canada, we have Heinz Pasta. This is, I believe, is 1994, and this is 2004. Same pasta, just different can, and different artwork. Uh, both unopened. And now let's move on to Europe. As we go to jolly old England, this is Marge and Maggie uh, from the Footprint statues. Uh, they made a series of statues. You hear my cat. Uh, I have, I think, three of them and I find them to be very, very nice pieces. They were in limited edition. Now this is a neat item. This is from Czechoslovakia. You see back here as it comes into focus you can see the word Prague as well as the date 1994 and this is just a simple little activity book but it was right after they uh, got rid of communism. So that was a neat thing. And then from Germany we have some soap from Maggie. Soap's still in there. And then from France, from the company of Tropico, we have the Bart Simpson ice cream holder. This is made out of ceramic. Very nice. One of my more favorite pieces. And from Italy, this is the remote controlled electronic car. They made a pink as well as a green version. This is the green version here. The pink version has just the pink body with the green tires. And these are very nice too. I especially like the Italian writing on the box. And now we go to Japan. And this is the beautiful CC Lemon lunchbox. I think I showed that in one of my earlier videos. Uh, any real Simpsons collector has got to get their hands on one of those. As you can see, you get a really nice 3D effect from the lunchbox. It's a really nice piece. And even if you're a lunchbox collector, that is a very nice piece to have. And then Ozzy Ozzy Ozzy, oi oi oi. Authentic Duff beer. Before 20th Century Fox told him, nope, can't make it. Unopened. And then from Australia, Kraft Macaroni and Cheese with the Simpson designs. You can see they got the pasta shapes of all the characters. And then from CC's which is like the Australian version of Doritos. You have the Simpson lenticular card set. I'm going to put this down on the floor. You can open it and you get all 32 cards and they all kind of move. I don't know if it'll work too well on the video. But here's the rare, uh, the two rare cards that are really hard to come by. And you open it up and you get some more sets. As they're on the pool or the lake. And that is Homer's nuclear power plant causing havoc. I got that about four years ago. I'm very happy with that piece. So there you go. Simpsons from all over the world. Um, if you have any comments or if you have any suggestions of things you'd like to see from my collection, please let me know. Again, I thank everybody who watches these. These are really fun to do. Uh, until then, this is Gus Banks saying thanks for watching. Bye-bye.